there a hob house? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I thank the Secretary of State for his update, and I, um, he's absolutely right to praise the outstanding res uh, results of Ineth Alvest, but it would be not right of us to expect such resilience for everybody, and I must agree with everybody who has raised concerns about the emotional well-being and uh, the people who don't have, have not received proper support um, um, and suffer from post-traumatic stress. But I've got a separate question. Um, has the Minister have any plans to address the issue of empty homes, of which there are so many in Kensington and Chelsea and elsewhere, which is not acceptable when we have so many families in need of a permanent home? The, the Honourable Lady, uh, Ms. Speaker, will know that there are already some measures in place to, uh, uh, to uh, uh, deal with uh, empty homes and to provide incentives uh, for them to uh, not be empty. Um, but in light of uh, the Grenfell tragedy, in terms of finding the number of homes, uh, there has been considerable progress over the summer in uh, acquiring uh, mostly uh, new homes, Kensington Row, Hortensia Road and others, and also there's been considerable work done in trying to convert some of the temporary homes that residents are in into permanent homes at their request. Mr. Paul Flynn. Statement report.